Hey guys, it's your boy Peppers, and welcome back to my FIFA Contain Leo Kurama, where last time I left off, I defeated Krasnodar in the Europa League. He to secure that I am guaranteed my place in the knockout stage. Just and I also defeated Angeras in the league, which has given put me in a good position because of something that happened with my uh early title rivals was Stadri ends and I will talk about that more as we get into this first game against Nance I think it's pronounced probably butchering it to be honest because well I always butcher it but um yeah anyway let's talk about this this what happened with Stadrians. If you're not, if you didn't see the last episode, and I encourage you to check it out, hope it's on the channel, or well, well, if you're new and this is your first video watching me, you might just found my channel, well, I would recommend all my videos because, well, I wouldn't be much of a, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be, I mean, it's kind of like a job. Part of the job as a YouTuber would be to recommend some of your stuff to people that are new. So, any of you that are new, go watch the past episodes. Because otherwise, you'd be like, okay, where is he? How, who, who is he signed? What's going on? I mean. I get. I mean. I'm not encouraging you to, to skip this episode. I mean, you can always watch this episode and go back and watch the other ones while you'll be out. You'll be a little bit ahead. I mean, and you'll know how I've done up until now, and especially in the last episode, because I just told you what I did in the last episode. But, uh, overall, you can see. How I got to the position that I am in in the league and in the cups as well because I've had cup matches and I am in the Europa League as well. Well, so it's it's a busy season and so far. And let's talk about the Stadrians match. Stadrians, well, not the Stadrians match. I haven't played them yet, but uh, before playing this match and until this match finishes. I am currently three points behind Stadrian, they're back in first place, but including this match, I have two games in hand, so after this game, I'll be back at top of the table on goal difference, but I'll have that game in hand even before I play Rians. So. Things are, things are looking good. Things are looking good. To say the very least. Now, um, I have, if you did see the last episode, you would know how that after that Angera's game, I did have another year. Hopefully, game that I said I would simulate the fifth group game, which was against Southampton, which over, oh, which truth be told, didn't have a, any consequences to the to it, and in the end, I came away with a two-one victory over Southampton and the simulation. Benzia got both my goals. Well, they actually had to come from one no down in the simulation. Because Buffal put uh, Southampton ahead in the 36th minute and put two goals in the second half from Benzia gave me the victory. So, yeah, very nice. Good to see that the second team was able to pull off the comeback. Did devoted to this particular manager. I don't know if it had anything to do with how the second goal came about. The uh, 
And when I say the second goal, I don't mean my second goal, I mean the second goal overall, the equalizer, came from the penalty spot, and the Southampton player, uh, Fonte, he was sent off. So, interesting and stuff right there. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous That he was sent off. Good play, but they've lost the ball now. And yeah. The opposition could get at them. Oh, whistle's gone. Free kick. Maybe that was the reason I got the second goal, but the second goal didn't, for me, the third goal overall, didn't come until a few minutes after. Or the uh, equalizer came in the, the 58 minutes from the penalty spot, huh? and the winning goal came in the 83rd minute. So, because you only need to know. Panicking. Well, this is how this team can play sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. Although I can't imagine that the uh, second team were probably pampering these uh, things and goal. Oh, all the shots. I mean, peppering, not pampering. Something. Two different words. Hmm. I don't know, can you guys hear me bashing circle button? Because it doesn't seem to be fucking working! The time to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Oh, it's the Pringle! Are you fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Did that seriously just happen? Yes? No! Oh, you've got to. It's okay, I'll get the goal in the second half. It's just a little annoying at the keeper. Where he's been... Hang on, uh... Has pulled off a few saves. He probably shouldn't have. I should have scored. Strong challenge. So yeah, I am... Attacking now. So, in terms of the Europa League, I am definitely going to be topping the group, and I am safely through. I think it's between Sun Southampton, almost at Sunland, that's a different team, uh, Southampton and um, Aberdeen, I think it is, for the, or it might be Crescent, or I actually have to check the uh, table. I think that, I think Southampton are still second, they might not be. I don't know. I'm for the home team, that's their next game. I'll check the Europa League table once this uh, this um, match is over before it starts the second game against CN. Lopez, whip it in. Yes? Are you joking me? Of course. That's that's just my fucking luck, isn't it? He's quite a door. Shoot! Try again! And a third time! He oh, probably should have passed down that third opportunity. Tongue tied there for a second. Yeah. Hey, when that happens. Passa. Lopez. Come on, make a run. Go on to Peru. Yes. I think this could be pretty easy. Ah. I saw that happening. I thought I turned away in time, but not the case. He's Carlos for them. Got the uh, tackle in. Maguba. Two fan. Foul. Yes. Gives me the free kick. Hmm. Can Lopez score it? Oh, he scores the save on. Oh, no. I do. In the 
and then scope bolt recovers to make sure the peripheral doesn't not in the uh, loose ball. Ready, squat, throw. Ah, oh, the peripheral wasn't quick enough to react to it. Gets his foot in there. Think the teammates the same Way forced the to throw. Two fan. Well, he's got the ball there in the defensive zone by reading the play very well. Think. Now the countdown. This is how they love to play on the break. Great challenge by Bassa. Lopez, him on the counter attack. Foul! No? Are you joking me? Drunk. Go home, referee, you're drunk. This is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, just a risk that they might get caught out. Way! I'm gonna make some substitutions. I'm gonna bring on Benzia. See how tired he is after the uh, game. Can you play on the wing? Do you have pace? You don't have pace. Does Benzia have pace? Because he can play on the wing. He is. Yeah, he is. He has good pace. Okay, right. So, sorry, Lopez. It's your bit of a sacrificial lamb here. I need some pace to get down that right side. Just to comfortably pepper the uh, goal and get that winner. And see ya. Thank you. Come on. Ah! Oh, course, you tackle me perfectly. Oh, we shall try that too fast. Deal. Square draw. Talio. Ah, oh, fuck. That's gonna be. That's gonna get him the point. <laughs> Fuck's sake! Liga Earth, no, nil, right. Nice, three, Bastia, one. Olympic Lyonnais, nil, Paris Saint Germain, two. So, what do those results mean to the league table? At the top of the table, remain Stade Rene with 39 points. I can't believe that's ever happening. See, yo. See what it means. Now I have to win my game in hand, whatever that is. In fifth and falling are Saint Etienne. In sixth, rising up the table are Nice with 21 points. In seventh, moving down are Montpellier. No, you won't be playing. I better see a goddamn improvement offensively from this team. Really got my blood boiling. I'm pissed. Ah, but and the results elsewhere work out as they would want them to be. First drop points in the season. 
hopefully it will be the only time I drop points. This is the Lille lineup. Yep, yeah, yeah, just fucking slice it, you cunt. And today it's just the one striker in the Don't do what you're fucking paid to do, and that's be actually somewhat professional well, in this game. You fucking mm, amateurs mistake. In fact, amateurs wouldn't even make that mistake. Freaking children wouldn't make that mistake. And yet you, who a professional who was paid thousands and upon thousands, makes that simple, simple mistake. It's fucking joke. Please, Square Joe, put this away. Thank you. Good to know that you still have your, or the ability to score a goal. Oh, oh, well, it's not gone since last weekend. Fucking joke. That's not even remotely funny. If it were, a if it were a funny joke, I'd be laughing. I'm not in the slightest bit amused. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. And the cross coming in. He's Clear that. Defender who got there first. In the header. Two fan. The Pirgol. Goal Lopez. Good progress with this attack. Yes, avoids the challenge. He can set up the Pirgol, thank you. Oh. Where was this last step? Last match. Privil, they've given it away so often. Hey, is it 3 0? Nope, because he missed. It's like the um, chance that frickin' Firmino missed against Southampton today. He narrowly wired the post. Post. Joke. That shot was a joke, and that. It's looking good, this move. That last game was a joke. Today's game was a joke. Ooh. None of it is even remotely funny. And the header scores. I'm not even. I'm not even celebrating any of these goals because uh, this. This is just piling on how unbelievable the last game was. You have three goals in the first 30 minutes here. You couldn't score one in nine against net. It's a bunch of idiots. With some danger. And here's the shot. Very good stop here. A well done, the goalkeeper. And he's hung on to the ball. Player right at him, but he's kept the ball well. Strong challenge. Well, a corner to come because of that deflection. I didn't mean to leave that for a corner. Good block. Pro. Foul. All of us score. Their corner. No foul, no goal. Well, this is just pissing me off further. It's quite a Oh, for God's sake. This one has passed him by. Yeah, I don't think you can knock him for. This is actually unfreaking believable. Another turnover in play here with that interception. It's quite The approval. Someone give me an option here. Mavuba! Good by the 
Straight at the keeper? Straight at the keeper! Can you hit anywhere else? Not straight at the goddamn keeper! Get up. Get the fuck up. Freaking knocked down like a fucking twig! Fucking joke! Crowd for a three minute add on, which is what we're going to get for added time. Give that go for the goal kick. Horn, just bring us into half time, please. He's probably the only one I'm not mad at because the defense didn't fucking need to do anything. It was, it's the, uh, it's the midfield and the attack I'm pissed at. I realize defenders can score goals from time to time. Well, oh. Oh, oh, but that's not their job. In the last game, they did their job. They kept the clean sheet. Made the challenge well. The offense didn't keep up its end of the fucking bargain and score at least one goal. The goalkeeper, it's his ball. Just a quick note for your diaries on EA Sports presenting the Ligue 1 fixture. It's Lille. They'll be facing Bordeaux away from home. Yeah, always enjoy visiting this. Good tackle. Too fast. The pearl. What was that move over? What was that? You know what? I don't care what it was. Because it just got you fucking substituted. Hit. Fucking random ass. His shit ass. Attacking now. That's not a good cross at all. And easy to defend. Given the ball away. We like to Please call the foul. Thank you. It's actually Mububa. Is he being booked? I was going to say. Yeah, there's no point in booking him. He's going off. Slight tackle, but he just. Off as soon as the player start. Shots on here. Oh, good save, Warren. Good defending. Approval. He's not got a lot of stamina left. This is it. And this is their fixture in league. He's gonna need to come off. His stamina is pitiful. He got retired in the last the in the last game and he's tired now again. Good to see it with us on EA Sports. Join us for that. Attacking well here. Not a great cross at all in the circumstances. Pretty easy to cope with by the defending team. Sir. And the away team wants it. Shoot. Jose Esquerdo. He might be through. But he's shot off now. And he's caught offside, trying to get in behind. He'll say that the pass should have come a bit earlier. Defence squeezed. They knew they'd caught their man off. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are 20 minutes to go. Can't win the freaking... Didn't even challenge. Didn't even challenge for the ball. Just let the fucking position have it. Just let him have it. Sidelines has made his intentions held. Esquerdo, come on, make the a run. Stop looking for the ball, make the fucking thing run. Jesus Christ. They put that cross far too close to the goalkeeper. How did the keeper get that ball? How did he get the ball? You were right in front of him. But you, you let it go past you. That's what you did. You let it go past you. It has been a 
choke the lot of you. In this football match, and we've known who's going to win for a long time now. It has been. Oh no! Don't don't bother taking the ball when you tackle him. Just tackle him, just for fun, just for fun. And it will go into the middle now, defending strongly there and making sure that Cross didn't get into the danger. I'm going to be as ball as my avatar, or or with the way they these idiots are playing. Oh, that's going to be a red card. Oh, thank God. He was lenient. He didn't send all of us off. Way! Dumbass. Makes a challenge here. Into the attacking third. Gone. Just blow the full time whistle, referee. It's 3 0, it's 9 if minute. These idiots aren't getting back in this match. And I'm sick to death of this guy that I'm recording. Thank you, God. I'm not even going to pretend like I'm happy about the win because I'm pissed, so pissed off about the draw. Liga earn. At least that ends helped out by losing. So I'm back to the top of the table. Still with the game in hand. But for fuck's sake. Should be he four points clear. Nil. Lille three. Con nil. Paris Saint Germain. No. Two. Bastia. Should be he so he points clear. Two, Montpellier two. Let's have a look at what those results mean for tonight's league tables. At the top of the table, we have new leaders in Lille with 40 points. In second, the former leaders, Stade René with 39 points. This guy's not going to be good enough. In third, Toulouse with 29 points. In fourth, Paris Saint-Germain with 25 Please, points. Please, give me some depth. In fifth, Saint-Etienne with 24 points. In sixth, Nice with 24. I'm gonna offer all these guys contracts. I don't care. They offered that. I need it. I really do. Seven points. And then reading up the table, second bottom and falling are Kong with 12. Did I offer this guy contract? No. Oh well, he's got an offer. Fourth bottom, Nancy with 13 points. Fifth bottom, Guy and Jean with 14 points. Offer you contract. Offer you a contract, yes. Yes. Offer you a contract. Offer you a contract. Offer you a contract. Okay, so um the two guys who aren't fifth, who aren't 16 yet, they need to offer. Everyone except them got offer contracts. And I'm gonna leave it there because I am utterly pissed off. I have more videos to record. I cannot be asked, but I have to. Thanks for watching. I'm Joe, and until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace.